Al Kiliwoto 3 Nuclear Power Plant Nuclear power has been widely used in around 30 countries, and about 30% of Finland's electricity comes from nuclear sources. In 2005, the Finnish government decreed that they should be using more nuclear power. If they wanted to reduce coal use, they needed to build more nuclear reactors. Plans included adding a new, very efficient third unit to the Alkaliwoto nuclear plant in Urojoki that would increase Finland's nuclear power production by nearly 60%. The first two blocks of this reactor were built in the 1980s and functioned as planned, while construction on the third block began in 2005. This is an example of a trend we can see happening all over Western countries building nuclear reactors again after a 15-year hiatus. From the start, the project was faced with delays in the construction. TVOs, which owns all Kiliwoto power plant, promised that the new reactor would open in 2010, but it is still under construction today. Early on, the project ran into a lot of logistic issues. There were disagreements over how to get the nuclear components to the site, there were also supply chain issues and delays that have held up progress for over 12 years and around $8 billion. The buildings have been done for quite a while, but there is still some work left to be completed on the nuclear components. There are few experts left in the nuclear infrastructure sector, which effectively put the brakes on reactor construction. In an industry with no professional guidance or new innovations to push innovation, business has been stalling for some time. In addition to this, Contractors weren't prepared for the strict standards required in order to build a safe nuclear reactor. This is because the concrete foundation was found to be irregular shortly before it was finished, meaning that it had to be redone. It has been discovered that contractors were forging metal parts of the reactors in a less than ideal way, and welders on the project weren't given instructions about proper welding before construction commenced. Planning for this project has been a challenge due to the amount of administrative concerns with nuclear plants. It has taken years to sort out all of the documentation and licensing, but TVO has finally promised that all Kiliwoto 3 will soon be open for regular power generation. Initially, the project cost was around $3 billion and has been increasing yearly. Due to the delays and difficulties, the total project is now estimated to cost $11 billion, nearly four times the original price.